Oh, I know. Welcome back to Match Day Live, and it's me, Dan, back again. And tonight it is the Manchester Derby. It's Man City against Man United. So this is the team I've gone for for tonight. As you can see, uh, with injuries and stuff like that, that's I think that's the best team that we can do with. Uh, but before I actually start the game, I actually, uh, if you guys are expecting a uh, career mode today, there won't be a career mode. Uh, just because I have, I yeah, I'm doing. Obviously, there's this match day live tonight, and there's obviously there's one tomorrow, so it will be. But it <coughs> match day, uh, the uh, fantasy career mode will be back next week, so don't worry about that. But tonight, uh, yeah, today is the match day live, so yeah, uh, yes. Yeah, so let's get into today's game, which is against Man City. Well, tonight's a game, actually, I should say. Um, yeah, so Man United have to face Man City, um, I, which I totally forgot about. I literally, like, I totally forgot about it. It's literally like, oh shit, it's on tonight, isn't it? <laughs> I, I literally, like, I literally forgot about it. So, yeah, I was like, oh, quick, I better do a uh, match day live for it. So, uh, yes, yeah, so let's talk about the last game before we talk about this game. Uh, obviously, we uh, faced Burnley at Turf Moor at the weekend, and we won 2 0. We got a goal. Uh, f it was, both goals were in the first half. Um, it was a first goal was Anthony Martial, who, on the blatant counter attack, obviously, um, blatant counter attack, and we pretty much. Um, yeah. <laughs> We pretty much started, we play, yeah, basically played them on the counter attack and we won 2 0. It was pretty much that, really. And then second half was, was pretty poor. Um, we did have a couple of chances to score, but um, it, it finished 2 0 in the end. So, yeah, first game, uh, first goal was an Anthony Martial attack. Um, we started with Martial and Rooney up front, and it looked pretty awesome. Uh, Martial got an inform this week as well, and I, I believe he got man of the match as well, which he deserves. So, oh, go on. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Martial scores, so there we go. <laughs> um, yes, so obviously with Ibrahim and, um, Ro Ibrahimovic out and Ro with Rashford and uh, Lingard playing most of the... Of the uh, game against um, Andelect in midweek last week we had um, had to play Rooney and Martial and Rooney and Martial did pretty well I have to admit that they did pretty well uh, obviously Rooney had a first 90 minutes in light for ages as well as I don't think Martial I don't think he lasted the whole game just because I think he will start this game tonight I think Mourinho will start because he is a bit on form at the moment. So him and Rashford up front with Lingard on the wing. Well, I reckon it might be uh, Rashford up front, up top. But hopefully it's Martial up top. And then obviously um, play Rashford on the wings. with uh, Rashford and Lingard on the wings. So yeah. Um, yeah. So back to the Burnley game. Um, it's Martial who scored. It's like, it like a counter-attack. Uh, Martial, he, he like won the ball in our, um, like in our box. Well, not in our box, in our in our half, our own half. And he kind of carried it for like 40 miles. Oh my God, 40 miles for like he kind of kind of carried it for like uh, 40 yards. Passed it to Herrera, and then Herrera just uh, put it back to him across goal, and uh, he almost he almost missed. Um, yeah, one one Sane, obviously bad defended by me. Um, yeah, we almost he almost missed. Uh, he, it's like one on one with Heaton, and he did beat him in the end. So there we go. Uh, that was two, one nil, and then literally uh, like five or se five or ten minutes later, Rooney was through, and oh, you should have got that. Rooney was through, and uh, well, not Rooney was through. Uh, it's like a bit of a weird goal this one. Um, I think Pogba won the ball, and then he passed the ball to uh, not Ibrahimovic. He passed the ball to Martial. And Martial just went into the box, and uh, Tom Heaton went to him. And I think what basically happened is, um, oh, what well, ball? If we can get that, yeah. Um, what basically happened is <laughs> he kind of like passed it to. Uh, well, he had he made like a like Tom Heaton made a save and then it kind of went straight through Tom Heaton 
it well, it kind of went underneath Tom Heaton, and then Rooney was the first one to react, and obviously scored. Oh, I hit that. Oh, unlucky. He obviously scored. Uh, just he, like, he just clips it in to, into the net, and he just scored. So that was two 0 and that was pretty much it uh, after the game. Pogba had a couple shots. Oh, look at that, Valencia on the score sheet. <laughs> yeah, uh, it pretty much we you know had you know uh, pretty much all the possession, and we play, basically played the game out. Really, um, it was it was a good game to win, really, because. It obviously put pressure on Liverpool. <coughs> put pressure on Liverpool as well. So Liverpool went up against Crystal Palace and they lost two one, which was quite surprising. Um, and Crystal Palace won deserved that. So we are still fifth. Uh, I think we're level on points with City. Actually, I th no, I think City's got sixty four and we've got sixty three, and Liverpool got sixty six. So if we win tonight, we do go fourth. But. Um, I've got a funny feeling it's going to be a draw, but <laughs> hey ho, I want us to win anyway. Um, unfortunately, we did get an injury from that um, from that game. It was obviously uh, Paul Pogba. Paul Pogba just looked. <laughs> Look at Valencia, fucking tank. Oh, and it's Martial makes it three-one. <laughs> yeah. Um, pretty much, uh, Pogba is like uh, like. He, I think he went off in the end, but he was pretty much knackered, and he is a uh, he is a uh, very very doubtful for tonight's game. I know. Uh, I think Mourinho did say that he won't be playing this game tonight, so I don't think he will be uh, Pogba. So Pogba might be out for maybe not for tonight, but maybe he will be back for the weekend, maybe uh, against Swansea. So yeah, that's going to be look a game to look forward to on Sunday. Uh, but yes. Let's get on to uh, this week's game, well, this tonight's game, which is against the Man City. Obviously, it's the City Dart, it's a Manchester... <laughs> convenient, three shots, three on goal. <laughs> yeah, uh, we've conveniently um, got, uh, yeah, it's Man City on a Thursday. Last time we played Man City on a Thursday, Man United won 5-0. So, I doubt that, yeah, but that was like in the 90s. So, I doubt... Um, Man United will f win five nil tonight, but if I if like if we can get like a cheeky one nil victory against um, Man City, I think we I think we could be on for you know the top four, but um, it just depends on like our, our our results and stuff like that. Um, but City themselves, obviously, they played Arsenal all the weekend in the FA Cup, so they will have a I think they will have. Uh, and I think no, we've got an ex no because we yeah I think we got the exact same amount of games played. So yeah, it's definitely one where where we need to f win this game. Um, yeah. So <laughs> uh, yeah. So like, what am I? Oh, I'm, I've <laughs> completely lost my thought. Uh, yeah. So Man City obviously they uh, lost to um, Arsenal weekend. Arsenal out the weekend if in the FA Cup but and I think they did lose a couple of players they did lose uh, Guerrero and Silva which is kind of a good thing to get um, but I know they've got that Sane who's quite a good player they've got uh, that Jesus uh, G Gabriel Jesus or Jesus whatever his name is he's a very good player he might be back tonight um, for them but you know David Silva and them this David Silva and De Bruyne who makes that team work and Oh, what a goal from Lingard, 4-1. Um, yeah, so it's going to be a huge miss for them if David Silva doesn't uh, play for them. But obviously it's De Bruyne who we need to watch out for. And if we can, I think, if we can get, I think it, we might see another tactical masterclass from uh, Mourinho tonight. Um, I, I, I expect we might, you know, get, I think we might attack Man City uh, like Arsenal did, you know, if... Man, if people actually attack Man City, they are very des uh, They are very, um, they are very, uh, you know, very open at the back. Especially when they have uh, either John Stones or anything like that, or um, Kolarov at the back. And um, I think that will happen tonight. I think he will probably play Man City on the counter attack. We obviously with Rashford, Martial, and Lingard. I think. That will be the game plan, obviously, and have Carrick and Herrera in that centre mid, and obviously have Mkhitaryan should play. Um, if he doesn't play, I'll be very surprised 
if he plays Fellaini instead of Carrick, I wouldn't be surprised either. But um, I think he should play Carrick instead of Fellaini, uh, just because of that reason. I know Fellaini did play most of the game on Saturday, on Sunday. Oh, what a goal! Six five one, Rashford. Uh, yeah, I know um, Fellaini did play most of the game on on uh, Sunday, so I expect he should play Carrick and Herrera in midfield, and then obviously have. Uh, Daily Blint and by yet again Blint and by did very well as well at the weekend. They were a bit shaky at the start. I have to admit that they were a bit shaky, but uh, they actually did. You know, they got the clean sheet last weekend against Burnley. So I think they can do it tonight against Man City because they haven't got the best. If obviously if Aguero is out, you know, and they haven't got like they haven't got like a proper stri if they don't have a proper striker tonight and in. Um, you know, either Sane or what, I don't know who they're, who they're going to play up front tonight. But, um, yeah, so it'd be quite interesting to see what uh, team he does go for. Pep Guardiola, obviously, uh, same team. It'll be like, it kind of, I think it will be the same team here that I've got that will face um, Man City tonight. Obviously, Mkhitaryan, Rashford, uh, obviously, De Gea in net. I'll be surprised if he plays um, Romero in net, but I don't think... It will be, it will be, oh, cross field ball, go on, Lingard, get that, oh, yes, um, I think it will be, oh, what a ball, oh, <laughs> Mkhitaryan, unlucky, um, I think it will be a very tough game, because obviously, um, Man City at home, they are very dangerous, but I think if we play them on the counter-attack, like, uh, if you remember, I can't remember, like, ages ago, uh, is Leicester against Man City. Leicester played them on the counter attack, and Leicester won four nil. So, and don't forget, also last season we went to the Etihad, and we we, we did win one nil through a Rashford goal. Who is on form? So, if we can have like Rashford and uh, Martial on form tonight, and then obviously play these two up front, and then have you know obviously have Lingard and Mkhitaryan like behind on the wings or something like that. I think that might be the game plan from Mourinho tonight, but obviously, um, I can see, I thought I was in then, I can see um, Pep Guardiola, you know, going for the possession and, you know, making us work for it, so it's going to be a very, very hard game, it's going to be a good game to watch, hopefully, obviously, uh, we're going to be without Pogba and uh, Ibrahimovic, but I think we can do it. Hopefully we can do it. I'm going to go for a cheeky 1-0 victory. Rashford to score like we did last season against City at the Etihad. So, yeah, there's my score prediction. I'm going to go for 1-0 Man United. Or it might be a 1-1 one -one draw or something like that. But I'm, you know, I'm definitely going to go for a Man United win. Because we need to win to get top four. So that's that so anyway guys i think i'm actually going to end it here for today yeah so please like comment and subscribe and i shall see you guys next time so right i'm going bye